fact, many of the barriers are still up around Center City and Broad Street. People came out last night even after the Eagles lost. It was pretty much just one last hurrah for a pretty good season. We were expecting to, you know, turn up, but, you know, we come back next season, you know, fly Eagles, fly. Greased poles or not, Eagles fans are letting out their frustration. I absolutely thought we were going to win. I just had no other thought we were going to win. It's disappointing. They were all wide open. How do you and now, waking up from the nightmare, the opinions are flying. We would have won the game if they didn't throw the flag. Now it's I worse. Ah! And I hate to say this, but I'm going to say it because it's true. The Eagles blew the Super Bowl. Sports radio has been filled with sadness, with anger, and finger pointing. We let Mahomes sit there and just make phone calls, order pizzas. He was just doing whatever he wanted to do. We didn't blitz. We stayed in zone coverage the whole entire game. We only got to him once. And it's just ridiculous, man. It is we should have we, we should have won that game. 94.1 WIP host Joe DeCamera said there will be time to praise this team and its successes later. But for now, it's time to vent. You know, the reality is this game, I do think, leads to a lot of different descriptions from people of exactly why the Eagles lost. Because it can go in a lot of directions. Yeah, and the only benefit today is a lot of people got a late start to school or work or just called out sick. You know, we definitely wouldn't blame you for that. Uh, so, yeah, no parade, not this time. But one thing we do keep hearing is that, you know what, there is always next season after all. Live in Center City, I'm Matt Delusia, NBC10 News.